Hi everyone, it's Amanda here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to make a no-line watercolor card and for that I will be using Bristol smooth paper, some brushes, a bit of water and I will be using distress inks for stamping. I'm going to use light distress inks also because they blend with water and this is the stamp set and coordinating dies that I'm using today. Now for coloring I'm going to be using the Karin Brush Markers Pro. So once I have everything stamped, it's time to start coloring and this first flower is going to be kind of a test because I wasn't sure what I wanted to use for blending. So first I'm trying with the colorless blender brush and then I'm trying with a regular brush and a bit of water. So I like that better with the brush and the water so that's what I will be doing and as you can see here I'm just going around the lines of the flower with my marker and then I blend everything in. Now if you feel that like you need more color what I do is I take an acrylic block, I add color from the marker on top of it and then with a brush I add that little bit of color into my image. You will see that in the video but I wanted to explain just in case.
since it took a while to arrange all the flowers, I'm going to be using one of my favorite tricks, which is press and seal to keep the flowers in place, and then I will stick them to the card. Now for the sentiment, I will be using a pre-printed sentiment that already comes on a piece of cardstock and you just have to cut it out. And all the supplies, as always, will be listed below the video and on the first comment. You will also find a link to a visual supply list in case you have trouble finding something. that's all for today I hope you liked it thank you so much for watching and here you have a couple more videos and links you might be interested in have a wonderful day and see you again soon bye